Hi there, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and thanks for dropping in today. I'm so excited to see you for my hand improvement video. Now in the first half of this video, I'll be showing you a great hand cream because I did a test of actually four of them and found the absolute best one. These were highly rated hand creams and I really love the one that I chose. And stick around till later in the video because I'm going to show you a wonderful test that I'm going to be doing going forward to actually anti-age my hands rather than just put lotion on them every single day. Actually, I'll be doing both the lotion plus the anti-aging and do stick around because I think it is something you might want to try. But before I get into that, I did want to show you the outfit that I'm wearing today. There's not much jewelry. It's mostly the outfit and the outfit is actually pajamas. And these are my absolute favorite pajamas. In fact, on my very first Instagram outfit pic, I showed a picture of these pajamas in my bedroom and it's because they're my absolute favorite. They're comfy and cozy. They're classic and they come through the washer and dryer absolutely beautifully. I have washed these probably twice now and they really look great. And if you're not yet a subscriber to my channel, I hope you'll consider subscribing. It's totally free. And if you click that little bell that just sends you emails of my future videos, most of which are about anti-aging and feeling good in our second half, and if you could give this video a thumbs up, that would be great too. Okay, let's get into this and I'm so excited to share this with you. Well, basically what happened is sometimes people will ask, you know, what do you do to make your hands look so good is what they say, which is really nice. And it's kind of a laugh to me because 10 or 12 years ago, I had the worst hands you would ever see, like out of a horror movie. I'm going to try to find a before picture to show you those hands and I'll link the video below. I actually went to a doctor in New York State who did sclerotherapy on my hands and it got rid of, you know, most of the veins, obviously not all the veins, but my hands actually looked presentable after that point. But I never did like hand lotion. I always felt like it was greasy and grimy and grossy and I just didn't like it. And then maybe about a month ago, I was in my car where we always see ourselves at our worst and I looked down at the steering wheel and my hands looked old and alligatory and dry and thin skinned. And I thought, Beth, no matter how much you hate it, you have got to get some hand lotion. So I went to Amazon. This is what I normally do. And I look for the absolute highest rated creams. And I chose three of them and purchased them. One of which was very expensive. The other two were reasonable. And I'm going to be showing you the best one out of those four. I'll show you how I did it. Basically how I did it was I started on my right hand using this gold bond crepe corrector hand cream. And then on the left hand, or actually this was on the left hand, this was on the right hand. I put on this Nivea three in one anti-aging Q10 hand cream with UV filters. And I wore this hand cream for a couple of hours. This one felt greasy and grimy, and this one felt really nice and moisturized and very nice. So that one won. And then I decided to test this one, the winner, the Gold Bond Crepe Corrector Hand Cream against the L'Occitane Cream Mains Hand Cream, which this was an expensive little guy. And thank goodness I didn't buy the big size. I think this was near 20 bucks and it's just this little tiny thing. And I thought this would be my winner for sure, but when I again took the winner, the Gold Bond Crepe Corrector, and tested it with this one on the other hand, this was the worst of all of them. It was really greasy and grimy and gross. It never dried down. It was always sticky, didn't like it. And then I remembered that I have a lot of City Beauty products because I happen to love them and they do sponsor me some, which is great. So I went in and I decided to test the City Beauty Restoring Hand Treatment against the Gold Bond Crepe Corrector Hand Cream. And unfortunately, even though this guy is a little pricey, he didn't win, so out he went. And then I realized that I really liked this one and I wore it for a few days. And then I looked in my skincare bin, I would say, I've got a lot of skincare in my bathroom, because I thought I had another Gold Bond cream in there, and I did. This is the Gold Bond Age Renew Retinol Overnight Body and Face, uh, Body and Face Lotion. And the interesting thing to me is, this one says seven moisturizers and three vitamins. And this hand cream also says seven moisturizers and three vitamins. And they're actually both called Age Renew. No, they're not both Crepe Corrector. This is Crepe Corrector. This is Retinol Overnight. But I decided to use this one on my right hand against this Gold Bond. And actually they were extremely similar. 
I really enjoyed both of these. And if you're interested in a good hand cream, maybe you wanna get this one because it's a little less costly because you know you get a lot more in this, but this one is more convenient to carry around. So anyway, I have been using and loving both of these on my hands, primarily the smaller bottle because I can carry that around and I really like it. Well, I'm all about anti-aging here on this channel, and that generally to me means not just using a moisturizer, which is basically what a good hand cream is, it's a moisturizer, to cover up your fine lines and wrinkles, and then they would come back again in three or four hours. I really am always looking for more permanent solutions, and I had tried using tretinoin on my hands, but it was so irritating, I just could not tolerate that. So I remembered that I had done a video about this different adapalene gel, and this used to be prescription for acne for kids primarily, but then it became over the counter and you can get it on Amazon for like 15 bucks, it's great. And I had done a video about it because I use it on my neck now because my neck cannot tolerate the tretinoin, but it can definitely tolerate this much milder Differin gel. And the neat thing is they have done studies about adapalene, which is the active ingredient in Differin, and they tested it against tretinoin in terms of its anti-aging effects. And surprise, surprise, this little guy showed equally good effects in anti-aging faces. And so I thought, why not use it on my hands too? So, and I've only done this for maybe three nights, but I'm going to keep it up. And let me know in the comments section if you'd like to see a future video to see if I actually did get some permanent results from this, some more permanent results. But what I do is at night, I put the hand cream on and then I take just a little pea-sized amount of this. Um, I've actually ordered three more of these. This one's about gone, which makes me panicky. But I take about that much of the different gel and then I just, normally I don't have rings on. I don't wanna get my rings all gucky. But basically I just do this um, along with the hand cream and then I go to sleep and I wake up in the morning and you know, I think my hands look nice. So if difference results are the same on anti-aging my hands as they are on anti-aging one's face, I think I've hit upon something good. Well, thank you for being with me on this hand improvement program video. And if you have creams that you use on your hands or any kind of treatments that you use on your hands that you particularly love or that you particularly don't love, I hope you'll share the information in the comment section below the video because that way we can help each other. Okay, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day and I've been loving these Mind of a Champion cards. And the reason I like them is they are affirmation on one side and then a daily action on the other, a daily action that supports that positive affirmation. And just the other day, I was looking through those cards and I found one I particularly like. And here it is, I will always hold my head high. I will always hold my head high. And then it says on the other side, set high standards. Self-confidence comes from within. Hold yourself to the highest standards even when you think no one is watching because you are always watching. Hold yourself to the highest standards even when you think no one is watching because you are always watching. And you know, this is so true for me lately in terms of what I've been trying to do with my life and my life direction. I recently retired, maybe about a month ago, and that's given me a lot more time and opportunity to work on my YouTube channel, which I really like. And I have to admit that when I was working full-time and trying to do YouTube kind of full-time, my standards weren't very high. My makeup room was a mess. My files and my computers were a mess. I just was barely holding on, like, you know, like a cat, you know, holding on to the top of a window or something like that. I could barely keep my head above water. I don't know if that's a good analogy when I'm talking windows. But anyway, you get the general idea. Things were kind of falling apart at the seams on the inside. And since I've retired, I've spent a lot of time getting things organized in this makeup room. And a good tip for you is, basically, I don't leave this room at night until everything is put away and my computer is closed down for sleep. So that's how I'm keeping things neat and tidy. And I've also really organized my files in the computer. So I have set myself to a higher standard, to a higher level of service, even though no one out there sees it. And that has really made me feel good because although no one else out there is watching, I'm watching and it gives me a feeling of self-confidence knowing I'm doing the absolute best I can. So friends, let's you and I, as we go through our day, look for areas of our life where we can set a slightly higher standard because if each day we do a little bit better, over time, our life becomes quite outstanding. 
Take care and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.